Hello and welcome to the channel. If you haven't done so already, make sure to like and subscribe. You know, in this channel, we like to expose these scumbag dealerships from the nonsense. So we got another one. Um, I might screw up the name, so we'll just call them the scumbag dealership. <laughs> Let me move my head. There it is. There's the name. Scumberg? Scumbag, I guess. Schwarmberg? Schwamp? Schwamp? You know what? We'll just call them scumbag. <laughs> scumbag for short so um scumbag for short uh scumbag to the dealership would love to um charge you an additional four thousand dollars regardless of what kind of car you buy so if you get the base model toyota corolla you're gonna they're gonna add four grand on top now none of this is posted on their website the note is laughable <laughs> but you know what do you expect most of these dealerships they're just caring about their bottom line that's that's it you know they got a big overhead and they have to pay millions of dollars with all the inventories and stuff like that so you know it makes sense for them to you know just make a little extra for themselves and they want to and the reason they give over here trying to <laughs> it, it, it's just bullshit but anyway i'm going to read it to you and then we will talk some more note it says do not remove from desk do not do it all right don't do it this is from upper management oops oops <laughs> i zoomed in too much as of september 8th and this is an older note i guess and somebody posted it um recently in the beginning of the month i just been too busy with other stuff to make a video on this so anyway here's the note what it says due to current market conditions regarding inventories and in oh my god i cannot see it Hang on, let me see. Ah, here it is. I can read it better now. <laughs> um, inventory, it's, and in the interest of retaining all current employees, they want to use that as an excuse. But let's just say you move 10 vehicles and you charge everybody $4,000 on top. That's 40 grand. You're telling me you need 40 grand every single month in order to retain your employees what no way so my question my next question is going to be how are other dealerships that are selling for msrp or close to it how are they surviving if they if you're pulling this kind of bullshit anyways Retaining all employees, we have to increase our new car and truck pricing as follows. All new cars and trucks are sold at MSRP. Bullshit. Plus a minimum of 3,994 in predetermined aftermarket products. I've seen your website. I've gone there and it does not say anything on there. It just lists the cars for MSRP, but I'm pretty sure once you go to the dealership <laughs> and you go through the paperwork and you're going to run into this. So, and actually somebody ran into this, they saw this and they were like, we're out of here. So this is what they wrote here. Shout out to Akon. High boost, Akon. He says, they're forcing a 3,994 aftermarket package on all new vehicles. Online prices does not mention any of this. We wasted our time coming in just to get scammed for a package that isn't even on the vehicle. The mistake you made, you make is trying to buy a Toyota without asking me first. Scumbag Toyota is crooks. Always playing those games since 2010. <laughs> Anyways, let's, let's finish this amazing letter amazing it's so good it's so good so 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 so, so good <clears throat> ask your sales professional or any sales manager for additional detail we hope you understand our circumstances and your loyalty is very appreciated obviously not during these difficult time warmest regards scumbag toyota management now here's the funny part here's here's the funny thing too um most dealerships, well, at least in my area, there are certain ones that are still selling for a fair price. Like the Crown Toyota next to me, that's right. It's literally like about three miles away from my house. Crown Toyota. They advertise as selling for MSRP, but they do put it on their website as well, too. So you know exactly what you're getting. And I've actually called them 
myself. I called them and they answered. They said, so even if you want a, a GR Corolla, the core model, they will not charge you a markup on the vehicle. They will just charge you accessories. And I've seen their website and I will show you their website as well too. And I also have Scumbag Toyota. <laughs> Scumbag Toyota. Um, I have their, their website up here too. So we're going to pull up these two right now. Let me see. I think whichever one I can click on first. Okay, so this is Scumbag Toyota. <laughs> you see, you just put, you get rid of the ha right here, and you have Scumbag. And then get rid of this Scumbag. Oh, bug. Scumbug. Scumbug. Scambag. That's what we should call them. Anyway, so as you can see on their website, there's nothing listed. Um, what the hell is TRCRP stand for? I don't know. But on their other vehicles, you can see that they do add on some stuff on here. Like this one right here. It says dealer installed accessories. So 2995 The um, car retails for 29000 This is a Camry SE. So this one, they actually advertise the, oh, the, um, the additional accessories that you're going to be getting. Usually when you click on it, it should give you a breakdown. If my internet wants to work, yeah, that's it's just a little, a little slow. So right here, when we click on, so as we can see, this is what you get for two thousand nine hundred and ninety-five dollars. You get add contrast stitching, preferred per prefer trees, carbon wings, and or piping. What? And or piping? That's not very descriptive. Come on. All right. So that's Scumbag Dealership right here. So when we go to the dealership in my area, this is the uh, this is the dealership right by my house, Crown Toyota. So they do have a base model uh, GR Corolla red. I, I don't, honestly, like half the stuff that they show online, they might not even have it at the dealership. So because sometimes those cars move pretty quickly. So as you can see here, my dealership here, they only offer, I don't know, I don't know why I say my dealership. I don't own it. I don't work there. So yeah, if they done something wrong, I will bag on them. I don't care. So they're offering you a max shield. So what I've read on, on the internet about it is it's a um, warranty of some sort that they may include. So anyway, so that's scumbag dealer. <laughs> so anyway, <clears throat> so What's seriously shady is how the dealer tries to convince Toyota customers to just accept the situation. It claims it has to add these charges in the interest of retaining all current employees. Oh, <laughs> that makes it sound as though if you're not willing to pay for whatever predetermined aftermarket product, Scumberg, Scumberg decided you should somebody might have to get fired because the dealer simply can't afford to pay its employees which is crazy now <clears throat> now as defenders of the dealer who consistently sell at msrp it should be noted that it almost sounds as though scumberg uh, sells close to it but the mention of a minimum 3994 really seems to indicate the pricing is about a transparent there as gr corolla circuit forged carbon fiber roof so, you know, and this isn't just this particular dealership. A lot of dealerships are pulling some of these stupid scams, trying to just part you with your money. So you better do your research. And also on your final um, bill of sale or whatever it is, your contract, make sure you go through all the lines and see exactly what you're getting charged for. Everything there has to be what you agree on, what you have agreed with the dealership to. So just make sure, because they will sneak in some some stuff in there when it comes to the um the final signing of the paperwork that finance manager will try to get you to buy additional warranties because they get a kickback from the company so they sell it for a certain price and then <laughs> well they they sell it for a higher price and then the finance manager gets a cut of that of whatever they sell so just watch out for that all right and uh happy hunting out there it's pretty rough buying uh, brand new cars it's which is sad every time i drive around Every time I drive home, I see the dealership's inventory. It's usually pretty full. Even the Toyota uh, Corolla, I'm sorry, the Crown Toyota by my house, dealership lot is pretty full, which is crazy.
because I would assume Twitter would be flying off the shelves. But I, <laughs> I guess they're not. But anyway, if you enjoy the content, as always, make sure to like and subscribe if you haven't done so already. And I will see you guys in the next one.